pink hotel, a boutique and a swinging hot spot. Don't it always seem to go that you don't know what you've got till it's gone? Let there be no doubt about where Ireland stands. We want nothing to do with a backward-looking idea of sovereignty. We remain absolutely committed to the ideals of the European Union. The overall capacity of nature in Ireland has been stable, but because our population has grown, biocapacity per person is down by a third. <laughs> Because our population has grown, biocapacity per person is down by a third. No! Ireland is doing badly because of high carbon emissions, consuming as if we owned 3.2 planet Earths per year, 80% more per capita than the global average. Yet there is a lot. That <laughs> down by a third. Planting more trees, re-wetting bogs and restoring wetlands could help reverse that. It means that we have consumed or exhausted the entire year's allowance of natural resources and ecosystem services. That's water, air, soil and all of the other ingredients essential for life. Mother Nature simply cannot keep up. Ireland is doing badly because of high carbon emissions. Recycling more and consuming less would certainly reduce that. <laughs> if we consume the Earth's resources too fast, we could be heading for collapse. Overshoot day now comes two months earlier than in 1999. Yet there is a lot that we could do. Here, the report also shows the overall capacity of nature in Ireland has been stable. If we consume the Earth's resources too fast, we could be heading for collapse. The Global Footprint Network says that is exactly what is happening. Put up a